I'm Eddie with On The Spot Carpet Cleaning. Today I want to talk to you guys about iodine, uh, urine contamination, and how to treat it. So this is Daisy, and Daisy has been causing her owner quite a headache. I should know because I am her owner. All right Daisy, go play with your brothers. All right. So we want to be able to ID and identify, and you have to have the right tools to identify urine. One of the tools we like to use is a UV light. And in order to use the UV light, you have to have some darkness. And uh, once, turn it on and we ID. So, you can see, there's a spot there, a spot there, and there's a spot there. And I'm gonna go ahead and mark those spots so I know where they are. Now that we've ID where the urine, where the daisy has uh, urinated, now we gotta make sure that that's the only spot the urine has traveled. Now that's important because just because if I treat this spot right here, doesn't mean I take all the contamination. And you wanna make sure that you have the right tool. Now this is pulse meter, and what this does is it penetrates into the patty and it senses the moisture. So as soon as I Stick it in, you hear that beeping? It means it's still moist. So, see, the original stain was in this area, but we're almost two feet away and we still have moisture. Me, that urine has traveled all the way down here and I have to treat this whole area. Now there's three types of contamination, the level one, level two, and the level three. Now this is the level two because it has penetrated the fi uh, fibers on top and into the padding. But because this carpet still looks good and it's not degrading, uh, we haven't quite moved into a level three. In order to treat this, we want to make sure that we soak this whole area with an oxidizer and absorb all that with a water cloth. I'm going to go ahead and take care of that right now. But remember guys, don't waste your money. More importantly, don't waste your time. Hire the right guy the first time. I'm Eddie with On The Spot and thanks for watching.